Assalamu alaikum and a very good morning to all. Welcome back for subject English class 7. So students, in our last video, we have started unit number 3, Gopal and the Hills of Fish. So here I just give you a short recap of this previous class. There was a season for his fish. So each and every person just talking about the hills of fish. The fishermen, the householders, even the courtiers of the king's palace also talking about the hills of fish. One of the courtiers said to the king that, Should I see you, the huge hilsa which I caught? That time, the king became very angry and immediately stopped that courtier and said that you are a courtier, not a fisherman. So talking like a fisherman in the court. The courtier completely felt silent. But that time, the king also felt sorry for that courtier and said that it's a season for hills of fish, so definitely each and every one talked about it. And after the king said that, it's not possible to stop everyone to talk about the hills of fish. And he said that even it's impossible for the Gopal also. So that time Gopal said that, Your Majesty, I think I could means I could stop. So that time, the king said that, okay, so you have to bring a huge hilsa fish to the court. And you have to bring the way so no one can ask you a single word about the hilsa fish. And that time, Gopal accepted the challenge. So now we'll see what happened in the next. A few days later, why is your face half shaven? I'm dressing up to buy a fish. After some days, Gopal making himself something different. Now you can see in the picture, why is your face half shaven? Might be she is the wife of Gopal. She's asking Gopal that why are you making your face half shaved? I'm dressing up to buy a fish. And what's the reply of Gopal? I'm dressing myself like this way just because I want to buy a fish. What's the matter with you? Why are you smearing yourself with ash? I told you I'm dressing up to buy a hilsa fish. And what she's asking? What's happened to you? Why are you smearing? Smearing means dubbing or you can say that applying yourself with ash. And Gopal replied that I'm dressing up to buy a hilsa fish. Means he's making himself a perfect, he wants to give himself a perfect look to buy a hilsa fish. Listen to me, please. You can't possibly go out in those disgraceful rags. What are you up to? How many times must I tell you, woman? I'm out to buy a huge hilsa fish. So here, Gopal's wife is saying again and again to Gopal that please don't go in such a shameful torn clothes. Disgraceful means shameful and rags means torn clothes. So here we can got it that Gopal wore a torn clothes. So here Gopal's wife shouting that you cannot go in such a way outside. That time Gopal replied that I said to you many times that I'm out to buy a huge hilsa fish. I make this dress up. I'm dressing myself 
like this way because I want to buy a huge hirsa fish. It's happened to him. He's gone mad. And after maybe seeing again and again, she become tired. So finally, she said that it's happened to him. He's gone mad. Maybe he's become a mad. Means he's not listening. So that's why he accepted that it taken place many times. So maybe he's become insane. He's become mad. Now let's see what Gopal actually going to do to complete his challenge. Gopal bought the hirsa fish and started walking towards the palace. Now Gopal bought the hirsa fish and he just walking in the direction of the king's palace. Now you can see in the picture he has carried the fish in his hand. Mother Look at that man isn't he comical and look at the appearance of Gopal and he's not thinking anything that what the people might be see him in a very free mood he's just walking to complete his challenge one of the child said to her mother his mother that look at that man isn't he comical Then look at that man look at that person he is really looking very comedy very ludicrous now look at this picture people are talking with each other related gopal he must be a mad man Shh, i think it's a mistake and what they are talking must be this person is mad i think it's a mistake hush is a you can say is a word which we can use to keep silence so they are keeping silence they are saying to each other that keep silence it's very difficult to explain mistake means it's difficult to explain that he's really mad man or not when gopal reached the court what do you want means finally he reached to the court and no one can observed his fish everybody observed gopal only everybody observed his stone clothes everybody observed that he has applied ash on his stone clothes on his body on his fish everybody observed that his fish is half shaved but nobody observed fish now let's see what happened in the palace when gopal reached the court what do you want i want to see the king and the guard who is standing outside who is guarding the king's palace they asked him that what you want gopal replied that i want to see the king means i want to meet the king it's my desire to meet the king you can see the king get away with you and what sir guard replied that it's your desire to meet the king but you can't means we are not allow you to meet the king get away with you means just go away from here be off from here gopal began to dance and sing loudly but gopal after listening this answer has not just walking but he stopped there and he started to dance and sing loudly means he started to making a loud noise he started noisily in a loud way some voice now we will see in our next video that gopal became success to complete his challenge or not or the guard allow him to go to meet the king let's see in the next video